pigmented nito oh. again candy for today's video sobrang excited talaga akong i-share to sa inyo guys this is the bad habit athena and aphrodite eyeshadow palette these palettes are exclusively selling at shophush.com for only 12 dollars or roughly 600 pesos yon pero i was able to watch a reviews youtubers na 10 dollars nga lang daw ito dati pero as of the moment nung binisit ko yung site i think nagtaas sila to 12 dollars. They have an app sa phone but unfortunately the app is not currently available here in the Philippines. I have tried downloading it sa App Store or sa Google Play pero hindi talaga pwede. I was able to buy online at Alox Beauty Studio. I'll be linking down below na lang yung Instagram username nila. Or dito ilalagay ko na lang Instagram shop nila. I was able to buy this for 1,400 pesos. Then Alox Beauty Studio is selling 100% authentic cosmetics. This video is not sponsored guys ha. Binili ko sila on my own money. Gusto ko lang talagang i-share sa inyo kung saan ko nabili para ma-experience nyo rin kung gaano nga talaga kaganda yung palettes na to. A lot of YouTubers claim that these palettes are exact same dupe of the Huda Beauty eyeshadow palettes. Sabi nila, Aphrodite is a dupe for the Huda Beauty Rose Gold Edition and Athena is a dupe for the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk palette. Huda Beauty palettes are $65 so that's roughly 3,250 pesos. Yes, guys, ganun siya kamahal. Kaya naman, sobrang excited ako na itry itong mga palettes na to. Kasi if they really are a dupe, girl, sobrang worth it niya. So, without further ado, let's find out how amazing these palettes are. So, let's go to the packaging. Both palettes are in the same packaging. May box sila pareho. And magkaiba lang talaga sila ng color. Then, at the back, it says the ingredients. Designed in Los Angeles and... It's cruelty free. That's what we love, right? Cruelty free. Here's the actual product, guys. It's semi-matte, lightweight, and my magnetic flap siya pag ino-open or sinasara. Ayan siya, guys. See? Meron siyang magnetic flap pag sinasara. I'll be using lang this Athena muna for you to see. Then, the palette comes with a full face mirror and syempre protective film and 18 color eyeshadow collection. Pareho sila guys na 18 color eyeshadow collection. Now let's go to the swatches. Let's start with the mattes, then the shimmers. Here are the swatches for the Athena. I swatches from the lightest, then to the darkest. Inuna ko yung mattes, then the shimmers. Here's the Aphrodite. There, that's the swatches guys. Sobrang ganda nila, diba? Some shimmers are foiled or richly textured metallics and they are all very pigmented guys, even the mattes. It definitely shows how pigmented they are. The colors are really beautiful pero let's see the color payoff when applied directly on our eyes. Actually, sweethearts, gamit ko si Aphrodite palette ngayon on my eyes. As you can see, ayan siya guys. Now, let's start to the video how this palette performs and how I did this look. Okay, so let's start the actual application of this Bad Habit Palettes. So, ito sila guys. Ano bang gusto nyo gamitin natin for today? Mm, siguro I'll be using this Aphrodite na lang muna and I will make a separate video or makeup tutorial dito sa Athena Palette. So, for the base, I'll be using this MAC Paint Pot Pro Longwear in Soft Ochre. So, gagamitin ko lang yung fingers ko para i-apply yung primer sa eyelids natin. I prefer using my fingers lang in applying the primer kasi mas nakukuha nung lids ko and hindi siya nagkakaroon ng streaks or yung brush strokes. Mas gusto ko talaga gamitin pagka fingers lang. So for the primer, para mas umangat yung colors na ilalagay natin, maglalagay tayo nito and it actually makes our eyeshadow long-lasting. 
Now, to set our primer, I'll be using this shade Koi as our base and apply it on my eyelids. So, kuha lang tayo ng fluffy brush. I'll be using this Weaver brush and apply it on our eyelids para lang din hindi mag-crease yung primer na nilagay natin on our eyes. Then, I'm going to take this shade Admire using a fluffy brush lang din as my contour or transition shade. Top of the excess. Then, apply ko lang siya sa crease back and forth para magkaroon ng depth yung ating eyes. Mag-apply lang tayo until the inner corner of our crease. Then, just a tip guys, kung nag apply kayo ng eyeshadow, mas maganda kung titingin kayo pababa sa mirror kesa sa ganyan. Kasi para mas makita nyo talaga kung okay na ba yung application or yung color ng eyeshadow sa mata nyo. Then, to deepen the crease, I'm going to take the shade Jealousy. Darker brown lang siya compared sa Admire. Para lang mas madagdagan ng depth yung eyes natin and mas mag-intensify. I'll just pack the color here. Lalagay ko lang siya on the outer corner of my eye until the middle. Then, whatever is left on the brush, tsaka ko siya ibiblend. Yan. So far, sobrang dali niya i-blend and I usually dip the brush on my palette lightly. Pero okay yung color payoff niya. Ayan, as you can see naman. In blending the eyeshadow, guys, I usually make it in a circular motion para mag-blend siya ng mabuti. And mawala yung mga harsh lines. When you're done, let's just add more color to intensify our eyeshadow. And I'll be getting this shade Lust. So I'll be using this Zoeva Lux Crease. Girl! Sobrang pigmented nito, oh! Grabe. Ayan guys, as you can see, pag dinadip mo siya sa palette, medyo powdery siya. Pero pag in-apply naman siya sa face, wala namang fallout. So, Lagay ko lang siya on the outer corner of my eyes. Then, hindi ko na i-apply until the inner corner para lang magkaroon ng dimension yung eyes natin. Then, with a clean fluffy brush, let's just blend everything para seamless yung finish and walang harsh line. Take time blending lang, girl, para mas ma-achieve nyo yung gusto nyong color sa eyes nyo. I keep it high as possible, guys, kasi kung mapapansin nyo, medyo hooded yung eyes ko. Kaya pag gumanya na tayo, hindi na makikita yung color na iyalagay natin sa leads. Pero hindi naman yung aabot sa kilay. Gusto ko sana ma-maximize yung paggamit natin sa palette and matry natin yung ibang colors para malaman natin kung okay talaga siya. Let's use this shade Seduction and I'll just pack it on my outer V and blend. And let's concentrate on the outer V of our eyes. By the way, I used this brush. Smaller brush siya para mag-focus siya sa outer V ng eyes natin. Hindi siya mahirap i-blend. Talagang pag nilagay mo siya, sumasabay lang din yung color sa desired application mo. Then, after blending everything, let's get this shade Heartbreak to intensify the color. Let's try to achieve a more dramatic eyeshadow ngayon, guys. And with the same brush, I'll be getting this shade Heartbreak. Sobrang curious akong ilagay ito sa mata ko, guys, kasi sa swatches, nakita nyo naman, grabe talaga yung pigment niya. So, onti lang, kasi baka masyadong maparami yung lagay natin. Ilalagay ko lang din siya on the outer V of my eyes para mas mag-intensify yung color. I'm not really an expert in applying eyeshadows, guys. Kaya pasensya na kayo kung ito lang nakakayana ni ate girl nyo. <laughs> oh, diba guys? And with a clean brush again, blend lang natin ulit. Then I'll be going back in this shade Lost para magbumalik yung red sa mata natin. I'll just blend it on top of Heartbreak. After that, guys, let's make a cut crease using this Skill Cover Pro Artist Concealer. I'll be using this Lux Precise Shader from Zoeva. 
And after that, dito sa part na to, blend it with your fingers na lang. And after applying of the concealer and pagtapos na tayo sa cut piece, it's time for some shimmer. Ano kaya magandang gamitin, guys? Ang gaganda kasi nila lahat. Tingnan nyo, oh. Ayan, oh. Let's just use maybe this Love and Beauty. Let's see. Pero let's try using our fingers first. Kasi ako, mas gusto ko talaga naglalagay ng shimmer using my fingers instead of brush. Kasi minsan yung color payoff niya pag brush yung gamit, hindi siya masyadong kumukulay. Ooh, grabe girl. Tingnan nyo. Sobrang pigmented niya. Wow. Ang ganda ng color. Guys, kita nyo. Hindi ko lang siya malagay ng maayos dito sa dulo using my fingers kasi dahil sa mahaba yung nails natin. Let's try using this brush from Zoeva. This is the Lux Classic Shader. Oh, ang ganda. Ang ganda, ganda, guys. And I'm done with love. Let's try adding more color to our eyes. I'll be getting this shade Beauty. Wow, ang ganda. Ang ganda ng beauty, guys. Kasi, I don't know if you can see it, pero sa akin, sa so nakikita ko siya, parang siyang red na nag-rose gold, na nag-orange. I'm so in love. Then, after everything, guys, I'll just go back to the matte shades that we applied kanina. Yung Admire, Seduction, basta from light to dark, para bumalik lang yung color on our outer V. So, when you're done blending, guys, maglalagay na tayo ng color on our lash line to create a smoky effect. So, I'll be getting this shade Admire and I'll just apply it on my lash line. Then, the shade Jealousy. Then, this shade Lust. Then, the shade Seduction. Yeah, tapos na tayo with our eyeshadow. I think I was able to create a parang cranberry look na medyo dramatic, guys. I hope ma-appreciate nyo, guys, yung gawa ko kasi hindi ako rin talaga expert in applying eyeshadow. Hindi ako magaling. I just really tried my best on this one. I just finished the rest of my makeup, my eyes, and my face. Then, I'll get back to you. Hello, sweetheart! So, I'm back. I'm done with my whole face. Tapos na ako mag-makeup. So, guys, hindi pa ako naglagay ng highlighter kasi napansin ko, guys, nakita ko tong piece dito sa Aphrodite palette. Ayan. Ayan siya, guys. Iniswatch ko siya. Napakita ko naman sa inyo kanina. And I think parang maganda siyang pang-highlight. So, let's just try and apply this on the inner corner of my eyes. Lalapit lang ako, guys, para makita nyo. So, here... Wow! Ayan guys, makikita nyo. Ang ganda niya. And of course, on the brow bone, gamit lang ako ng fan brush from Wet n Wild. So, ayan siya guys, on our brow bone. And, gusto ko rin siyang itry sa face kung mag-work and kung maganda. Let's try it. Uy, pwede. Girl, it works. Pwede siya. Pwede siya gawing highlighter. Maganda. Lalo na in person. I don't know if you can see it, pero ang ganda niya in person. Lagay din tayo on or keep it bow. So, ayan guys. This will be our final look. Ayan. So far, sobrang nagustuhan ko yung look na to. Hindi ko in-expect na ganito yung kalalabasan niya. Now, let's go to my final thoughts about the palette. For the $12, kung magbe-base tayo sa site nila, $12, guys. Tapos, ganito kaganda yung pigment and yung color payoff niya. Sobrang worth it na niya for me. Pero kung magbe-base tayo doon sa price na pagkabili ko online, which is $1,400, it's a little bit pricey, pero okay na rin siya sa akin. Sobrang bet na bet na bet ko sila. Well, kung i-compare natin kay Huda Beauty na $65, which they look identical naman as per the photos, though I don't have it yet lang, girl, dito na ako. 
go get yourself one of these palettes from Bad Habit. It's really, really worth it. Ang ganda ng mga pigments nila and the color payoff. And kung titignan nyo naman, sa $12, di ba guys? Yung packaging niya, hindi nyo makakalain $12 siya. Kasi it looks classy. Sobrang mukhang mamahalin niya, di ba? Pero... Yung presyo niya guys, okay na okay siya. Sana lang talaga magkaroon ng store dito sa atin sa Pinas or mga online shops na nagsasell nito. Please mag-sell kayo nito so all of us can enjoy how beautiful these palettes are. Kasi I can say anything, sobrang ganda talaga nito guys. Please mag-sell kayo nito. I'm loving the look and I'm super in love with this palette guys. Hindi ko na-expect na ganito yung kalalabasan ng look natin kasi as I've mentioned nga kanina hindi naman talaga ako magaling mag eyeshadow because I am not a makeup artist pero I tried my best so ito yung kinalabasan niya. I really really love it. The texture of the palette guys, it's a little bit powdery and hindi rin siya sobrang creamy or buttery. Then what I also love about this palette is that sobrang dali niya i-blend. Hindi siya yung pag nilagay mo sa eyes mo nagpa-patchy siya. Walang ganun guys sobrang dali lang talaga niyang i-apply and i-blend. Kaya hindi kayo mahihirapan. Even the beginners like me, may enjoy nyo talaga yung palette na to. Kaya I really recommend this product, guys. You have to try it. I'll be linking down below the products that I use from this look and kung saan mabibili yung mga palettes na to. I hope you all enjoyed this video and if you do, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell below para lagi kayong updated on my next uploads. Thank you for watching, sweethearts. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Bye!